we are actually visiting Houghton Province as well as the uh, Western Cape. And in Houghton Province, we are visiting uh, various uh, SEZ uh, Special Economic Zone site in next to the Oliver Tambo International Airport, as well as the, uh, some uh, uh, companies like Sasso and uh, GDDA or uh, sort of uh, uh, site we are going to visit. Our main partner is uh, uh, departments uh, like uh, departments innovation and science, uh, department trade and industry and competitions, and of course the uh, presidency. Uh, those government uh, departments are now facilitating uh, the development of hydrogen. So we are talking, uh, we are discussing with those partners how uh, you know how to cooperate uh, each other. Our governments, Japanese government, has already uh, launched um, a special program uh, for the hydrogen uh, development uh, in 2020 uh, for the uh, transition of the uh, energy. And uh, we understand that uh, South Africa uh, has, uh, you know, a little of uh, platinum uh, in order for us to produce the uh, hydrogen. Uh, th this, uh, uh, this is uh, a very much uh, advantage uh, to, to produce the hydrogen. So that is why we are, are looking at uh, this country. Sasol has a very good advantage uh, in this area. So that is why uh, we are uh, you know, discussing, we have been discussing with uh, those people. But however, uh, not only Sasol, but also other uh, stakeholders or you know, potential partners we need because uh, we, we Japanese side, uh, different people and different industries and uh, uh, different uh, technology we have. So we, we not just a uh, Sasso people, but also we would like to find out, uh, you know, more potential partners in this country. So far in South Africa, 80% uh, of your uh, electricity is uh, coming from coal, I understand. But, uh, you know, hydrogen, it still, uh, you know, takes time to develop. So at this moment, we need to think about the transition time from the coal to uh, hydrogen. But uh, at the same time, uh, we are also uh, can offer some technologies for, you know, in order to uh, decrease the carbon dioxide or sort of technology we have. So uh, not just focusing on the hydrogen, but also we can uh, offer some uh, uh, technology through, uh, you know, at the, in the t transition period. So uh, we, we, Japan, has a sort of advantage uh, in that area as well. South Africa has more, you know, industrial, industrialized country compared to Namibia and also a very much sophisticated, uh, you know, um, government, um, public sector uh, organization. But in other words, the uh, structure of the uh, decision making is more complicated than Namibia, I would say. So uh, as I mentioned that uh, uh, energy transition from coal to uh, hydrogen, there is uh, some uh, argument between, say, you know, labor unions who are involved in the uh, coal um, production. So sort of the political uh, difficulties uh, may, may you are facing very much frankly uh, speaking, but uh, uh, you know, Namibia uh, does not have uh, sort of uh, challenges. So, uh, you know, um, I think uh, um, political leadership is uh, definitely necessary uh, to develop, uh, you know, this area more uh, faster. Uh, so uh, we would like to, you know, uh, communicate and collaborate with your governments uh, to uh, uh, development, uh, to, to develop in this area.